trying to do a video about the fact that um, Venus is in Leo. Let me get my my full-on apparatus going because, you know, um, I have a feeling that, um, well, the glasses aren't really that good for us. Um, where is my, I'll do a little overview here. Yeah, oh, wow. Well, I'm looking at the 14 degree Taurus on my moon. Sorry. Um, I could go like this and, and uh, do this and maybe go like that. Isn't that fun? Um, <clears throat> thank God there's, that there's Uranus right there going over my Venus. Well, it's trining. It's good. It's, it's, it's positivity. Like unpredictable things are actually in my favor if I really open look at this and whatever unpredictable thing like those those little kids that yelled at me um that were actually laying down more asphalt they just brought attention to the, to the fact that that was happening and i know that it's happened on oh, here i go about the fucking asphalt again see i'm not somebody who backs down really i mean if i if i feel like i'm being called to do something and the main call is to remain in a state of prayer Today was this the biggest dawn, and it's like, of course, I've always been doing this, but now you think I'm going to have to bring it into consciousness and say I meant to do that? Woo! Okay. I'm on top of having, um, well, you know, having lost, um, well, you know, losing love, I guess, is is the, 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 the way to put it. Why am I mentioning this? Well, at minute two, I'm going to try and begin the video again. Let's talk about our eclipse season coming up and how we are in the, we are in the um, place of, of the love question if you ask if you want to know what libra represents i mean it used to say i love so it's by um well today we have a six uh, a six degrees uh i guess it's the full moon today and of course these people over there you know that they brought attention to themselves well first of all they first brought attention to themselves by laying this asphalt everywhere and i just thought it was my neighbor i could see this big ass shit right there anyway pardon me babes God, I'm going to see, if you're wondering, I'm going to be doing, I, I get it, uh, you're going to see more about this because it's just me, I meditate and then it's like, oh, there's the answer right there, it's obvious, you know, so okay, but now I see I've never done this before, and congratulations to the people who have um, stood up and fought for themselves in court and done stuff like this, the truth is, is that the organic team needs to do this more, I mean, you have to do this more, you, you, um, if, you know, it's better than, um, I don't know, to each of their own, babe. It's, it's like, I would love to have fun out there, but don't you think that that having fun now is contrived by this inorganic, pop, uh, uh, inorganic influence that says, yeah, no, this is what your life is supposed to be. I mean, come on, this is like minute three and a half, and I'm talking about something that I've talked about in the past over and over again like what is going on here why is it more and more that um we don't know what's going on and but we but see we see talk about put on those glasses the they live people right what happens is they're they see something so different and i do too I, i'm pretty much it's just that their eyes open and they, and they just all of a sudden see they just wake up and they and they see something that it's really hard to start explaining explaining what we we can really see, let alone communicate with Pluto on your Mercury. And I don't think everybody else, like I said, like God, God's instruments, they have to be tuned up. They have to be actually fashioned up somehow. And what are those fashions for human beings? Well, um, are you um, doing your yoga? Did you meditate? Are you meditating? Period. Period. Um, do you have a, a traditional value that that points at we're going to keep this fundamental uh, kind of vehicle in order to get across this fucking river that is life really it's like a, getting across the lake river um, to, get to the other side we're not going to use that we're not going to always carry that around but it's something that works and what is it? Well, um, 
if you look at the canoe, <laughs> kids, and water and stuff, this is all truth stuff that you can't get away from. You're not going to build your canoe out of, of something that isn't um, going along the ley lines of, of the laws of promoting buoyancy. You know, gosh, you, know, you really need to know your language and stuff. And, and so the reason we do uh, YouTube us strange people that a lot of us don't even seem like we have it together, you know, and we we're, we may be way off, of course, because we, we are in the middle of a storm. I like that analogy of just, and especially doing astrology. It's like, by the way, Moon is doing this thing today. It's, I guess, supposedly today. It's looking at it, it's at six degrees, and that's when the the Moon um, opposes. Uh, it, it, it's a full moon exactly today, so it's at some time. Now I can see it was early this morning. It must be early, way early this morning. In fact, it could have been like you can see the minutes here. Yeah, there's a, there's a little bit of a discrepancy, discrepancy particularly with the moon. Uh, it was early in the morning, like at 12 11 or something. Um, So it's it's done, and we we, we um, are um, going to be feeling a lot more of the residuals of this brand new baby. I call it baby humanity is is getting uh, is just getting on its feet, and I can hear it everywhere. It's not a separate. Uh, you're not a separate, isolated incident coming awake. Like say here I am on YouTube saying something at two three four p.m. We're doing. Um, non-military time by the way we can still see the sun you know. although today we ha we had some rain and a little bit of uh, misty stuff that i would really question was like yeah the military spraying our crops you know just watch that babes watch your shit watch it you know it's a hell of a time to be living right now you know people won't notice it you know but they take on all the disease or diseases or cancer or whatever as if it was hereditary and it's like, no, there's a business out there. Can't you see it? It's a shimmery, fucking ugly situation. You, you'll never see anything more hideous than, than what is going on out there passing as a civilization. Sorry about that. I know I sound really bleak. Where's my other glasses? Do I have mirrored glasses? This is what I need to get. And you don't understand, babe. There's a certain kind of mirrored glass. I'd rather have square ones. You have to. It's rude. Um, it's rude to for the inorganic team for the organic team to not look each other in the eyes and give each other a zap. It's starting to get a little windy. And, uh, water flies out the trees. Um, but so if you if you put on these your glasses, and you don't have to give energy to the to the um, inorganic team. Um, stuff like that, you know, and if you if you need to wear a mask, I mean, sure, you know, I would rather have armory. I, I, I think that we should have, well, because of the EMF waves, please take this on and, and, and mail me something if you think it's already there. I mean, if you found it's already there. I mean, I think it is already there. I live like in the 1800s. I love it. I'm trying to get a horse and buggy going. I want to, I want to TP outside and I want to be able to light fire in there and have just be in there um, night and day. Just just let the house just leave it alone uh, and figure something else out. I'm serious, man. It's already set up out there. We don't have to worry about anything. We really don't have to do too much. <sighs> Getting back to humanity, baby humanity is having their birthday. I mean, it's going to be ongoing and um, we're going to figure out things that real scientists who have been killed, you know, there's like how many in, in the last six years or so is more than 400 people have been off because they hold a simple cure. Hi there, Jesus. Was that kind of like you? Hell yeah, it was. What was the cure there? <sighs> what if you are the cure? Being, being a practitioner, that's what... Um, Thich Nhat Hanh used to call, who was it? Uh, uh, well, I think on his little commune there called Plum Village, 
um, there are practitioners now. These are therapists, I think. These are these are just people who are enlightened. A Buddha, a Buddha is just somebody who who is conquered of the mind. They can go in and out of the mind. They see it for what it is. They are perfect, like they are just a mirror. They're more like the 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 reality of reality that is is almost like it's it's the akashic record. You know, you're kind of going into their. Um, frequency of, of seeing memory and all that stuff and how it is it's so different being a master. Anyway, um, Buddhism is just, a, is just a conversation between two people. That's what Buddhism is. The ism of the Buddha is a conversation between two people. Now that I think about it, does is, is ism have to do with with just like conversing and, and communicating yes and there's the m there and then is is we already know what that is right is 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 it baby is it is what it is me i'm an is it's the truth and but then so when you have an m there that tells me mental mental you know and that's kind of Words go with the mind. Words go with mental. The language comes up into that, and we're going to give each other just kind of. It's there's two different ways to use um, communications. Of course, um, is there is it is it validating the truth or is it or is it trying to uphold a lie? So anyway, God, I get myself back. Here I am in the canoe, going, I'll be right there. That's the, what I'm trying to talk about, like making these videos during these times when, well, perhaps the people that make these videos, they're called to do something, you know, and they're, and they're freaky. They're weird. They're like, man, you know, I, I'm, I'm a black sheep, you know, and I did nothing, but just, I was really strung out all my life, but now I'm, <laughs> they're really actually having a good message for people and bumps people into, um, a possibility of, of, uh, getting what you want, you know, figuring out what you want, and then getting what you want, you know, um, where we really are, babes, if you, because some people are on, like, the tippy top, it's like, we already got what we want here, babe, it's all here, we can hardly access this, it, though, because, what, oh, 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 we, we have to, um, do the money thing, right, I mean, there's such a, everybody knows, babe, I'm not, see, I don't want to sound lazy or anything, like, I don't participate in what civilization hell is going on out there, no thanks, yeah, oh, it's not about making money, Pleasures um, do not come with us, to us. Um, money does not bring us pleasures. That's what I'm trying to say. And pleasures in life, it's skills. Skills do. People who know something about something and then they, they have a passion. And they, they create. That's what money is trying to emulate. If it... If it if it ever sat in a dock, in a dock on a yacht, and doesn't know how to sail at all, but there's just tons of yachts like that, and there's there isn't an owner there that knows the art of sailing because um, it takes skills <laughs> to, to sail a yacht and and really be in that storm and, and and be and have a reason that you're just sitting there relaxing after a while inside the harbor. And drinking your wine. That wine was made by somebody who, who had the skills to do it. It wasn't money that made it. They love their scenery, the, the vineyard and whatever's going on there amongst the denser part of the bushes. Anyway, I'll have to